Other than that. Hi, Nancy Sardell, um, helping, founder of Helping Mill Awareness with Southeast Michigan. I just, I didn't plan on speaking tonight, but I just wanted to clarify what Lorna had said. Um, I was, I was contacted by the Logonia Animal Control Officer. She said, where did you get the photos from of the Sussex Spaniels? They were in the basement, um, provided to me by the kennel worker that spoke to you last month. And um, those, in the photos, uh, you can tell that they're in a cage. They're wet and there's debris everywhere. So apparently those dogs ended up in Livonia. Within a couple weeks, they took this complaint, August 29th, they filed cruelty charges on the operator here in Farmington Hills based on animals that were seen by the Farmington Hills Police Department on July 29th. So, you know, what is taking so long, I think is the biggest question. If we had animal cruelty um, noted on the June 1st inspection. Police were called on July 29th. They saw the same conditions. Why is it taking so long to file charges when Livonia is able to file charges in their local jurisdiction? So, you know, everyone's pointing jurisdictional um, issues when I think the city should be taking care of um, the problems here. Every city has taken care of their hoarding problems in, uh, you know, in Oakland County. It's usually the zoning and the police department that handle these. They can enforce state cruelty laws. So I just I wanted to clarify that Livonia is taking action on this case. And it's a shame that we haven't we haven't seen more here when the police department was there. Those animals are still in the building. There's a closed state, but that doesn't mean she can't move somewhere else. Um, so progress to us is not closing the kennel. Progress is to ensure those animals are out of the kennel and she's restricted so she can't have animals anymore. We don't want her to move to another city. Monitoring's not working. I feel it's harassment with, if they have to go every week and check on these animals. We receive complaints almost every month. We had another puppy shopper come forward this month. We filed those complaints. Animal control was there the next day with the police department. How many people have to come forward before we remove animals? 90 degree weather, her AC, her AC guy called me. She doesn't have air conditioning. Animal control has showed up. The fans aren't even on. The windows aren't open. We have 90 degree weather. Those animals are still in there. This is, this is a sense of urgency. I can't believe we're here another month asking for action to be taken in the city. So uh, I, I appreciate your patience listening to me tonight, but you can see that if another city is doing this, you can see our frustration that those animals are still in here. And, and another kennel worker is still here pursuing this, trying to help those animals. This is an immediate um, situation we think needs to be addressed as soon as possible. Thank you. Thank you.